If your Mac operating system is corrupted and won't boot and you don't have another computer or bootable USB for reinstallation, then don't worry. In that case, I can guide you through installing three different Mac operating systems on your Mac using internet recovery. Hello friends and welcome back to MZ Learning. Friends Internet Recovery is a great tool that allows you to reinstall the Mac operating system directly from Apple's server. It offers three different options to choose from. You can reinstall the macOS version, which is currently installed on your Mac. You can upgrade to the latest version of macOS on your Mac, which is compatible with your Mac. Or restore the pre-installed Mac operating system that came with your Mac. All of these tasks can be done by pressing different key combinations at startup. Let me explain how. If you turn on your Mac and immediately press and hold the command and or keys together, you can access macOS recovery, which allows you to reinstall the latest version of macOS that was previously installed on your device. In my case, my Mac had macOS Ventura installed before the system crashed. So it means, if I press command and or keys during startup, then it will install the most recent version of macOS Ventura on my Mac. The second option is to install the latest compatible macOS from Internet Recovery. For example, if you press and hold the command, option, and or keys together, macOS Recovery may offer you the latest macOS version that is compatible with your Mac. For example, there is an updated version of macOS available, called macOS Sonoma. As my Mac is compatible with macOS Sonoma, so therefore, if I press the command, option, and or keys during startup, the internet recovery will install macOS Sonoma on my Mac. If you want to install the original macOS that came with your Mac, you have a third option. During the startup process, press and hold the shift, option, command, and or keys together. By doing so, macOS recovery may offer you the macOS version that came with your Mac or the closest version still available. My Mac originally came with macOS Big Sur. Therefore, if I press and hold the shift, option, command, and or keys during startup, the internet recovery will install macOS Big Sur on my Mac. So let's install one of them. For the demonstration, I will select the first option, as I want to install the same macOS version that was present before the system crash. To start the internet recovery process on your Mac, follow these steps. Turn on or restart your Mac, and immediately press and hold the command and or keys together. It may take a moment, but the internet recovery process will begin. You will then be prompted to select your network. Click here to choose your network. Click on your Wi-Fi. Now type your Wi-Fi password and hit the enter key. Next, you will arrive at the activation lock screen. Enter your iCloud credentials, including your iCloud ID and password. After that, click on next button. Your credentials will be verified, and if approved, you can click on Exit. If you're performing a fresh installation of macOS Ventura, it's recommended to format your hard drive. To do this, first select Disk Utility, and click on the Continue button. Next, in the left sidebar, select your disk, usually named Macintosh HD, and click on the Erase button. It's important to note that erasing the hard drive will remove all data on it. So before proceeding, make sure to back up any important data. In my case, I didn't have any data on my hard drive, so I clicked on the erase button without any worries. After erasing your hard drive, click on the done button and close the disk utility app. Now select install macOS Ventura and click on the continue button. Finally, click on the continue button again to proceed with the installation. Accept the macOS terms and conditions. Select the drive and click continue button. The installation process will begin. This may take some time, depending on your internet speed and hardware configuration. Your computer may restart a few times during the installation process. It's normal, so please don't worry. The installation process is completely automatic, so please don't touch anything. Just sit back and relax. After some time, you will see a screen something like this that asks you a series of questions. These questions are straightforward, such as selecting your location. Please configure your Mac by answering these questions according to your needs.
Congratulations! We have successfully recovered our Mac operating system using internet recovery. For more Mac related videos, please subscribe my channel. Thanks for watching, have a nice day.